one evening the spirit of lust <laughs> me just creep up in my clothes <laughs> and me grab him and say hey boy I want you like a wop you used to walk flat but no you yeah. The struggle is real. Working, come on, somebody. Ah, uh, one evening the spirit of lust. <laughs> Me just creep up in my clothes. I'm a grab him and say, hey boy. Hey, behave yourself. Come on, somebody. The struggle is real. I want you like a whopper. Come on, somebody. I want you and I want you bad. Am I talking to real people? Hey, hallelujah. But I realize that you can't get this. As much as you want this. Where the man them there? And this one to you. Come on, somebody. There is a barrier between us. And the Holy Ghost says your body is the temple of the living God. Me now go try it one time. Because it might nice me and me want to go back. So me have to shut it down. Come on, somebody. Clue, clue. Shut it down. Come on, somebody. Put a word on it. I will look to the hill. God. When a man tell us that you look good, mighty God, and you not even feel like you look good enough, you start neat up your eyebrow. You look at say amen. You start wearing nice a brassiere. You look at say amen. Oh hallelujah! You're real. You start walk different. I serve no way. You used to walk flat, but no you. So, the struggle is real, and then at the back of your mind, you say, If you want, if the man they call me one more time, someone would even say, Amen. Amen. And a real thing, me at all. Real talk. Real talk. Real old man. And when I decline. Rejected the promotion. The promotion. Hmm. More money. More things. Me reject it. Me said me no want it. Guys, me take the promotion. Yeah. Me go in a trouble. When I'm supposed to be checking a room. Yeah, check out. Out. Something else. <laughs> yeah, check out something. Let me get to the point quick and wrap it up. When I rejected the promotion, I said to them, So, no keep on no promotion. Me never tell them, sir. So. Said it nice. I said, Keep your promotion. So me can keep your sanity. My sanity. That's right. <laughs> and when the manager resigned 
from his position, he got a bigger job overseas, woman of God. The day when he was leaving, he called me. And he said, Shirlene, woman of God. He said, Shirlene, woman of God. I want to tell you that I love you and I respect you. They say when me go home, me do a dance. Yes. All right. Yay. Yay. Me do a dance. A time for someone to dance. Dance with yourself. Celebrate so you hold on to your sanity. For too long. 
for too long we have pity party poor me whoa the other day I asked God why and God said why not I was just having a conversation I said then God why and the Holy Ghost said then why not and me just shut up because if you do an evaluation what you been through somebody been through the same thing and he mad so me kill so me have some a walk on road mad but aren't you here today to give God praise come on somebody aren't you here to give him glory aren't you here to give him honor come on somebody I was sexually abused as a child amen and a lot of other girls that were sexually abused like me they died some of them are in mental institution come on somebody but you can't keep a god woman down come on somebody come on somebody come on one preacher this morning said when they lock up Paul and Silas they never got them out a man tied me down on a bed a couple years ago and the man run teeth in light through the bed it was a panel bed and the man decided to kill me yes and when I felt death creeping up I felt the sting of death creeping up on my body I felt when my feet got dead come get on shatter I felt when my feet got dead I felt when my waist got dead I felt death creeping in my stomach but I heard the word Jesus out of my belly come on somebody Come on, somebody, snatch the victory, grab the victory, in spite of the struggle, grab the, take it from them, take it from them, take it from them. No matter how you're struggling, if you ever open your mouth and say, Jesus, everything change <laughs> don't it say Jesus everything change say Jesus cause at the name of Jesus demons tremble come on somebody at the name of Jesus there is deliverance at the name of Jesus there is healing so grab your dagger you can't grab your dagger with your hand in your pocket. You can't grab your dagger with your hand full. We're going for the kill. Oh God, some of you should be further. Some of you, some of you should be appointed and anointed to offices. But you're having a pity party because of the struggle. And look what God allow. Sisera, if you come at your tent, come on somebody. The enemy is right at your tent. Come on somebody. The enemy is right at your tent. Come on, the enemy walking at your tent. Come on somebody, get ready, get ready, get ready. Hallelujah! The enemy lay down. <laughs> you believe it's coincidence? You believe it's coincidence why the enemy come to you for a glass of milk? Be still and know that I am God. I will be exalted among the nations. I'm going to be exalted among the heathen. I'm going to give you a testimony. Ah, oh, God Almighty, come on. And Caesarea put on the man and said, lay down. And the Bible says she covered him with a mantle. Ha, ha, ha. Get ready for the kill. Cover the enemy. Tell him, go on your bed. Because I have a plan. Somebody get radical. Get radical. Get radical. Put him to bed. Cover him up. Walk out of the tent. Draw out one peg. Go over him head. And stab him in him head. Someone will not even move yet. Someone will not even move yet. Jesus. Hey, hey. Someone will not move yet. Walk over. Hey, hey. Walk over. Walk out. Walk over. Walk out. 
She said, Sister Perry, I've been lonely. God Almighty. Lonely. God Almighty. Real lonely. She eat yam banana, cocoa, salt, everything. She lonely. Beard, everything. She have, she have feelings. Real stuff. You know call the nature of here? Yeah. She have feelings. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And she beard, and in her and in her work. And she beard, and in her work. Yeah. 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 No can say amen. She said, Sister Perry, one day I invited a man at the house to fix one zinc. And it was done. Jesus. And when he fixed the zinc, after the zinc, he said, one leak, the up there, so she said, fix it. <laughs> after the air, so he said, piece of something broke the morning, so. She said, fix it. And the man said, you look good, you know? <laughs> Devil, man. I saw. She said, Sister Perry, before a night, we were in bed. Someone not going like, no, 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 I'm not talking about. The man come for fix the pipe tomorrow, watch me and him. You struggle. Singing on the choir, but you struggle. You have the gift of laying your hands, but you struggle. You have the gift of prophesying, but you struggle. And you won't get help until you admit that this struggle is for real. Look at some of Hallelujah. I was invited to preach at a big national convention. And I asked a brother to bring me a cup of tea. All I asked the brother for was one cup of tea. Jesus. And the brother came in the room with me, fully air conditioned. The air conditioned turn up. Me cool. But when the man walk in with a cup of tea, your body get warm. That devil. That devil. All right. All right. I mean, what it happened to? I mean, what it happened to? Come here. I said, brother, can I have the cup of tea? That's why we're in a day and Jeffrey could come here. Come here, brother. Come here. I can wrap it up on you. Come here. Thank you, Jesus. We snatch some victory in here. We are running from Relax. Oh God, if you could hear this song. <laughs> All I asked the brother for was a cup of tea. <laughs> that nervous. My husband wasn't safe. <laughs> My pastor wasn't there. Pull out the cup, pull out the cup. <laughs> Get that cup, umbrella. Pull out the cup. And all I wanted was a cup of tea. I never look at a man so close in years. God, me love that woman here. The right. Jesus. Tall, dark. Biceps. Jesus. And trust him. The brother 
The spirit. She will become um, a molester, or promiscuous. Yes. That's what statistics say. But God said, yes. any time I save you, yes. I'm able to keep you. I'm able to keep that which you have committed unto me. Come on, somebody. Sir, get out of this place. Because if you don't leave, I'm going to rip you. You're not going yet. Run like Joseph. <laughs> the struggle is real. Is real. When he left the room, I fell on my face and I prayed. There were hundreds of people waiting to hear me preach. The <laughs> struggle is real. The spirit that is attached to the struggle will attack you anywhere. The spirit will show up. That's the devil. Oh, yeah, man, I saw the devil work. I'm going to pray and ask God to forgive me. <laughs> I went out and I preached. That's right. Like I was preaching my last sermon. Oh, yes. Souls were delivered. Amen. One soul got the Holy Ghost. Oh, yes. But the greatest deliverance was your deliverance was for the preacher. Yes. Ladies, the struggle is real. is real. Don't hug it up. Yes. Don't kiss it up. Be with it. Yes. Admit it. Yes. It's the way you feel. There are some spirits that are attached to you. Because of who you messed up with. There are some soul ties. Even after I got saved, a young man that I dated and he died. Years after I got saved, one night I had a dream. And in the dream he said to me, A long time I look for you. Jesus. I may say, I lie, you are dead. You're dead. Yes. That's right. We don't have no going on. We do it, dead, yes. The struggle is real. Is real. Yes. No pretty talk, no dressy talk, no tie talk. Admit that you need help. I'm closing. My husband got saved. Four years ago. Thank you, Jesus. One day I was coming from work. The Lord instructed me that it's time to go into your husband. Jesus. Instead of me. <laughs> Just the like Holy Ghost Esther. Says, go home. Dress up like Esther. <laughs> when I got home, Prepare yourself. my husband was in the city, sitting and he was praying. And he said he was praying, Lord, allow me to love only my wife. Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. God has rejoined us together. After 23 years of marriage, yes. 
the Lord delivered him just four years ago. Thank you, Lord. I was deliberate in taking out a thousand dollars before I got up here. And I'm releasing over this that I have snatched my victory in spite of my struggles. And I don't care who the enemy was sending on my space. No matter how you think you want this, you won't get this. Because this belongs to God. Isaiah spoke to the children of Israel and he said, God says to tell you that your warfare has been ended. You have struggled long enough. It's time Struggle, take it all, come plant it. Grab your